Welcome guys to Cast Heads. Finally, we're back on track with doing videos. It's been a very long time and I do apologize because we've been setting up. But um, now that we've set up in our new location, we're ready to make some new videos. And here we are with probably, hopefully, would be, would be a nice long installment of uh, cars and caffeine right here on Cast Heads Magazine. Uh, com and all our social medias. The reason for this is where we can have a nice uh, sip of our favorite beverage and dip into some of our favorite brands. But I've been dropping some fantastic castings over the last few weeks and last few months. Some of them are going to be coming out, some of them have already come out and have kind of missed the purview of many collectors around the world simply because of the deluge of models and scales that are coming out now on a daily basis, pre-orders left, right and center. It's absolutely madness and sometimes very hard to figure out where to put your penny and pound. But um, no, no worries, because that is what this show is all about. We take a look at some of those underrated models that kind of slip under the radar and uh, probably pass some of you collectors. So here we are, we take a hyped up, hopped up look at uh, some of these models. And this Friday, we are looking at something from Pop Race. First of all, I really do love Pop Race's new product uh, and uh, box uh, branding, to be very honest. It's really cool, the fact that you can stack it up like this and uh, have the cars um, all lined up in a row for those of you who like to keep your cars in boxes personally I like to get my cars out and on display but then uh, we know there is a very important segment of you that likes to keep it boxed up this is probably a great way of doing it without having the window and uh, it definitely I can guarantee you gives a fantastic representation of what the car looks like in real so it's great uh, great artwork so um, let's pop this open and um, as you can see here we go forgot that it'd be nice to show you guys the box being opened as opposed to having absolutely nothing there and um, just love this blue it's a special name which I keep forgetting and um, yeah, I'm gonna place it there let the Sun take over As you can see, this is the Toyota GT86, or sorry, the GR86, my bad. I keep living in the past and calling it the GT86, but actually, yes, it is the GR86 from Gazoo Racing. And um, Pop Race has been doing this in several colors. I have to say, this is probably my most favorite color. I love the blue that goes up against the... the dark uh, the black wheels they've got a nice uh, done a nice job on the wheels itself but the casting is actually quite good uh, i mean if you take a closer look at it um as you can see here the casting is the lights the placement the grooves in fact the the shape of the the body where the lights are aligned this is actually quite spot on and for those who are massive Toyota fans this is a great opportunity to get yourself a really good casting of this car nice looking beautiful GR86 Very close and look up. So there you have it. Thank you so much for joining us right here on a very quick look uh, at the Pop Race 164 GR86. Getting it right this time. License, by the way, is on the box, so that's nice to know as well. And um, yeah, looks absolutely fantastic. Definitely one for the collections. Catch us hopefully some more episodes of Cars and Caffeine right here on Cast Magazine.